Welcome back, my friends. You may recognize this handsome young man. This is my buddy Craig, and he always spins me right round, fixing me up. You may recognize him from Spinner as well. Today, we're going to talk about Gibbs Cam. Now, we always talk about Spinner. We're familiar with Spinner. We're familiar with the success of Spinner, the multitask, and the ability of have German engineering in your machine shop. But we still have to program it. We still have to make those machines run. And you, Craig, are quite familiar with Gibbs Cam, aren't you? I've got a few years in into Gibbs, yeah. Uh, I think I'm going on 20 years now that I've been working with Gibbs. Only 20? Only 20, yeah. Well, then this will be a good interview because you <laughs> might have a little bit of insight. Yeah, there you go. Why do you lean towards Gibbs Cam, Gibbs Cam for programming your machines, and where do you think this type of software best helps your customers? Well, I think, uh, you know, from my standpoint, Gibbs is like a one-stop shop. It can literally run every one of our products that we have in our full product line, whether it's a five-axis mill, three-axis mill, two-axis lathe, or even down to that microturn that, you know, is just like this little jungle gym all in its own right. So, um, Gibbs handles every single one of them, and including simulation, crash prevention, everything that I need before I go out to the machine tool, the software is taken care of for me. You brought up a couple of things that I want to continue to dive into a little bit more. Uh, user friendliness is important, but I've also, I also understand that machines are getting more complicated. So of course, in order to understand software, you have to understand the machines. And I want to talk about user friendliness in just a minute, but what you just said to me, I think is what I want to talk about first, which is crash prevention and understanding what's going to actually happen inside the machine. Sure. When I look at some of those spinner machines and I look at the capabilities of three turrets inside of there or a mill turn style where I have turrets on the bottom, milling capabilities on on the top. I've walked into a lot of machine shops myself, Craig. We're not even fully utilizing that entire CNC machine because they're scared to use it. Exactly. Software like this will help them understand and have confidence to use every aspect of these machines that they've invested in. Yep, absolutely. I bring in all my tool holders so I have a real world environment in the software. So like with the microturn, the microturn's moving spindles. So if the B-axis is in the wrong position, I'm gonna crash the spindle sheet metal. And Gibbs is giving me that opening to correct that or to actually fix it in its own right. So, so it's helping me to understand that, but you know, I'm bringing in the correct holders, I'm bringing in the, you know, the right tool lengths, all of that stuff, and, is, and if it's right in the software, it's right on the machine. I'm going to describe something, I think you'll know immediately what I'm describing, but I've had a few change underwear moments in my days. Yep. Of, you know Pucker exactly factors, what I'm yes, right. absolutely. And I learned programming on a machine line by line with floppy disk and moved into Excel, was actually my first true like programming software yep. to go along with it. I bring that up because if someone is to take on the responsibility of sliding from one CAM system into another system or is coming into it as a learning opportunity, are they going to feel confident that they can, they can figure out this software at a rapid rate in order to make these machines run, to uh, go ahead with being able to make the machines run as we just described to their fullest capability? Yep. I, I think the software is actually fairly easy to learn. Um, it's uh, the way the dialogues are is very straightforward. The, the way that you can manipulate the operations that you've created. It's just as simple as just dragging a tile back and forth. So it's, I think, very user friendly. Um, I think the dialogues are very clear, easy to understand. So once you've, you know, once you get your tool set up, once you get your operation set up, I think it's a very easy software to run. Intuitive. And intuitive. And, you know, when it gets into the multi turrets and the B axis machines, they get so complex without, you know, looking at what you have to do on a single operation that you've got the synchronization you've got all the other factors that go into the software that Gibbs Cam is handling and handling with ease. You know I find it interesting that we're having this conversation about complication of machines and all your different turrets the capabilities of done in one the software that's needed to make these things not crash and you know where we're standing? in a tech center in front of manual machines while all these young men are running these machines. So if you find that funny as well, leave that yeah. in the comments. Craig, as always, thank you for having this conversation with Absolutely. me. I love learning about Gibbs Cam and the partnership with Spinner. If you don't know about Spinner, give those guys a check as well. And thank you all for watching. We'll see you again soon. All right.